Let's talk about this. Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts. Let's talk about this billboard, shall we? I, I understand why they're asking for it, but I've not even heard about this until this morning when people took this image of the billboard in Los Angeles and saying, look what's happening. Like, okay, must be a really small movement, but hey, they got a billboard up and they're demanding for Tony Stark to come back. Let's read the billboard and let's discuss this. So, uh, for our beloved hero, please, and where Marvel Studios, the logo should be, they put bring back, and then in gold, Tony Stark. Hashtag bring back Tony Stark to life for 24-2021. I guess with that date, which as I'm recording and uploading this video is in uh, two days on Saturday, that's when they're going to start the campaign, I guess, officially of this. And people started theorizing that when the Snyder Cut was confirmed, it was coming to HBO Max, that more movements similar to it would start happening. And here's one. Here is one. Now, I get why people are asking for this. I, along with many others, have not even heard of this campaign movement until this morning when this started popping up on Twitter. That this billboard's a real thing in Los Angeles. Um, I get it. I love Tony Stark in the MCU, but he, as they say in the film, can rest now. That's what Pepper said. You can rest now. We don't need him to be brought back to life. There are ways to bring back Tony Stark in the MCU, but this is, this is not going to happen. Kevin Feige, along with everybody else there at Marvel Studios and the higher-ups, they have it all planned out. They have storylines, they have characters, they have films, Disney Plus series. They have all these things in motion. So, this is not going to happen. People are going to say, well, look, the Snyder Cut happened. Well, I think that was a special certain set of circumstances in terms of COVID, and then on top of that, you had uh, the demand, of course, was there, and it was like they had that huge rally cry on the anniversary of um, the theatrical cut being released back in 2019. Um, but you also had the fact that it was there was a whole entire film sitting there. With this, it's like you're asking to bring back a character who sacrificed himself in Endgame. It's just not going to happen. Like They're not going to retcon the events of Endgame to bring Tony Stark back. And if, if Robert Downey Jr. wanted to come back to play as Tony Stark, it probably wouldn't be the same Tony Stark. It'd probably be another version. Or if there's a film that takes place before his death, maybe. But that just, I don't know. I think it's a weird campaign. I think it's a little strange. But that's just me. I don't know. There's a lot of people responding. I responded saying no on Twitter. There's a lot of people saying, um, you know, we demanded be taken seriously. People are just posting like these memes. Wouldn't bring back Tony Stark back to life sound 10 times better. Layers of stupidity there. Bring Tony Stark back to life. Bring back Tony Stark to life. I don't know. Um, people are saying this is ridiculous. Pepper, you can rest now. These fans know. <laughs> um, death has to mean something. I love this negative 3,000. Why do they have to ruin everything? <sighs> Boo. Boo. Bring back Tony Stark to life is the worst hashtag imaginable. <laughs> I don't know. It, it, just for me, I just I just don't see any benefit for it. I mean, I get it. You're going to get Robert Downey Jr. back. But look, there's got to be a story point for him to come back and just to bring him back to life just because the fans are demanding it. Like, I don't think a lot of fans are demanding it. Not because they don't love the character, but because the character ran his course in the MCU in terms of what he did. How much more can he do? Probably, there probably could be some more. I mean, he hasn't met the X-Men. He hasn't met the Fantastic Four. But there's certain things you got to understand that you can't just bring him back just to, okay, now he gets to interact with Fantastic Four and the X-Men. That's not going to really add much more depth to story. You know what I'm saying? So, no. I don't know. This thing's a little ridiculous. But we'll see. I guess, I will see how big this movie will be in two days, apparently. Because they're saying 424 2021 which means in two days, as we're recording uploading this video, that they're going to start the campaign so i guess be on the lookout for the campaign i guess <laughs> i don't know <laughs> so what do you guys think of this um this uh demand this new hashtag what do you guys think of this movement to try to bring tony stark back do you want him to come back are you against this hashtag are you against this movie whatever thoughts you have about this let me know in the comments below guys i'm curious to know your thoughts talk to you guys soon peace out